Welcome back, everybody. Gonna be another playthrough here, Path of Exile. Continue this wonderful, wonderful Let's Play series. Now, we are at... What are we at right now? We are at Act 2. That is where we left off. And uh, I'll go ahead and just get right to it. Okay, so... Actually, let me check if there's anything that I need anytime soon. Uh, let's see. I have got Frost Wall, and I can't actually get that until level 15. But as soon as I do... Oh, man, this can be awesome. That's going to be awesome. I think we're all set. Let's go. Let us go along our merry way. All right. So act two, the forest. Whew. I'm excited. All right. So probably going to do about another hour today. Uh, thank you all for tuning back in. Hopefully this has been entertaining thus far and will continue to be entertaining for you as well. We have now entered the forest. Dun, dun, dun. I'm excited. Oh, so if you don't know, this game is free to play. That's obviously a big draw behind it. Um, and you can register. Well, it's not free. All right, you have to get it in the beta right now. But once the game is actually live, it will be free to play. So in order to register for the beta now, you just need to head on over to their website, pathfexile.com, and you can register right there. And there you go. That's how you do it. I had a lot of uh, a lot of questions in the comments. People asking me. How do I register for this? How do I play the beta, Force? That's how you do it. All right, so there's a lot of monkeys. <laughs> Got a blood chieftain. What are these little, what are these little craps called? I don't know. What are they? Blood apes. Blood chieftain and blood chieftain and blood apes. That's cool. Kill him. Kill him dead. Door shield. Don't need. Mine's obviously better. All right, let's try to find where I'm going here. Again, I don't need to take half hour killing. A single, uh, single mob. Take advantage of the uh, epicness that is AOE damage for my Frost Witch, and just engage large packs. That sounds fantastic. So, running along the river bend right now, trying to find my way. If you ever lost in the wilderness, uh, just head for water, <laughs> and then go south, and you're all set. That's how it works. People were asking about lag. I will mention that um, this is a beta. Force encampment. Look at that. That was nice and easy. Uh, I believe this is like... What is this? Ooh, looks like my next town. Oh, boy. This looks familiar. <laughs> Does this look familiar? Please tell me what this looks like. Just imagine that there is a dungeon right down there. Tell me what you think that that, that is like. So there's my stash. Yeah, so here we go. I got a new town. I wonder if there's any quest available to me right now. Not sure. Not sure at all. Doesn't appear to be so. All right, so I've got the old fields over there. And I think I saw something over here as well. Ah, here's a guy. Placeholder quest guy. <laughs> That's awesome. Oh, this is a beta. All right, let's talk to placeholder quest guy. Uh, hi there, because Act 2 quests are not implemented. I'm here to give you some placeholder quests until the Grinding Gear games get their act together and finish this act. That is funny. That is really, really funny right now. So I gotta kill that person. Okay. <laughs> That's fantastic. Alright, let me see. Let me check these quests here. Oh, that's not what I wanted to do. Alright, so, uh, kill Cry Crytan in the, at the Broken Bridge to the east. Alright, so I've got a quest in either area. Let me go first to River Cro Crossing. Placeholder quest guy. That's funny. I enjoy that. Excellent job, Grinding Gear Games. I always want to say grinding gears games. It just kind of rolls off the tongue a little more. But it is grinding gear games. That's what it is. All right, so I need to find... Ooh, look at these guys. That is Callow Sniper. Oh, he's dead already. Oh, okay, here's another big thing for you guys. Um, a lot of people are saying, wow, this looks really easy. Keep in mind, please keep in mind that this is the first difficulty. So, uh, obviously, we'll get more difficult as time passes. Uh, as, you know, we work up into the additional difficulties. I can't cast that when I'm getting hit, huh? That's disappointing. Goat's Horn? What's that? It's a wand. Hmm. I'm going to have to take a look at that. My wand's actually pretty junky. All right, what do I got here? 9 to 14 damage, 34 intelligence. Let's take a look. Yeah, that's better. Uh, this one's got extra slots, but it's not like I don't have those slots to begin with. Increased spell damage. Okay, so I'm going to take this, and what I'll do is I'll just hold on to this just in case I need those extra slots. Because this having three slots is phenomenal as opposed to just the one. But now I've got extra spell damage. The wand itself does a little more damage. All sorts of stuff. All right, so let's see if we can find 
whatever I need to find. I got two checks to kill. It says pla placeholder quest guy. Is that even worth? No, I, I'm not gonna use just the wand attack. That's terrible. That is terrible. Terrible indeed. So yes, difficulty, again, just keep in mind that this is, it's the first act. And on top of that, they could even scale it because it is still the beta. You know, they're still, um, that's why they're doing this to test out these things and see what, uh, see what the community thinks, what you guys think. But be it the fact that it is still the first difficulty, uh, once I finish all the acts and get to the additional difficulties, then maybe we can, uh, we can make a judgment as to its uh, ease or not. There's a little dude. What is like? What is he doing? Look at that guy. I don't. I don't think that's proper. I wish I could zoom in. I wonder if there's a zoom in key. Not that I know of. Fix that. <laughs> that should not have happened. All right, let's go along the cliff here. See what I can find. Can I climb the mountain? Hmm. Hmm. Oh, but there's gonna be a bridge back here. Take out these guys. Some more monkeys. Archers don't care. Going to the next area. Do not care about you folks. Force looks nice. See that there's a little uh, sunlight peeking its way through the through the canopy top. How do I get through here? There we go. Cathedral of Bones. Ooh, I need a quest, huh? You gonna tell me what that is? You gonna tell me what I need to get through there? Nope, doesn't look like it. Well, that's a pretty big bummer. Um, I would like to know what is necessary for me to venture into that area. I don't know what level I am right now. I'm level 12, okay. These mobs are level 16. So... Oh, and I also was informed it's nothing. I, maybe I was just misread because it says that it recharges in charges in combat, but it says you kill monsters. So apparently, apparently that's something that I missed and I was informed in the comments. So yes, uh, during boss fights, you actually can't rely on recharging of your uh, flasks because chances are, unless they have ads, you won't be, be kill you won't be killing many monsters aside from the boss itself. So. What you go into the boss fight with is uh, what you have, so make sure you save on to as much as you can before entering a boss fight. That is the moral of the story, my friends. That is what we have learned. Alright, there's a big group of guys again. Uh, I have noticed a little issue with targeting. Sometimes I'll be targeting in one direction, but uh, she will fire in another. And that's something that... Not sure if it's just me screwing up or if it's an actual issue, but I think it's an actual issue because I, I know what direction I'm, I'm pointing <laughs> in relation to my character. I'm well aware of uh, my spatial alignment. See, like, just there, I was pointing behind me and the arrow went the opposite direction. There again, see, same situation. In fact, I'm actually dying right now because I'm too, that, again. See, that's, uh, I don't know what that is. Is it supposed to be like that? But that's kind of buggy. And oh, I, it just happened again. All right, ready? Okay. Let me see if I can get it to trigger here. Oh, that time I was out of me. I don't know, but that, it just happened a few times there. So that's uh, frustrating. That's something I like to avoid. I would like that to be uh, remedied. Okay, this is uh, okay. It's a lot of guys here. Got to slow a bunch of them up. Try to get some of them frozen. There's actually uh, a special guy on my ass. <laughs> I'm not exactly thrilled about that. Okay. Got it. I got the uh, I got the high level guy cutting around the rest of these. I should be fine. I think I should be fine. Frost Nova or whatever the heck we want to call it. It's a Frost Nova. Don't kid yourself. Call it what it is. Ice Nova now reached level two, so that's good. I think I got them all. Beautiful. Gotta get. Gotta catch them all. All right. What do we got here? Uh, goat's horn. Why would that? Why are these not showing up anymore? Hmm. That's odd. Hmm. Nine to fourteen. What is the one that I have right now? Nine to fourteen. Yeah, let me see what this got for specialty. Uh, lightning damage and it adds fire damage. But I think mine's better. I think the one I've got right now is better. What I do need to check though is why. Uh, why those things aren't popping up for me on the ground. 
Uh, options. Where is this? Okay, here we go. Corpse targeting? No. Um, filter white items? Yes. Item and objects such as chests and waypoints will always be highlighted. That's what I need selected. Okay, good. I was wondering. Wondering why this stuff was not popping up for me. I was a little frazzled. I may have missed something, actually. I may have missed a super epic drop as a result of that, so that's frustrating. Alright, it's enough talking for us. Continue along your merry way. Let's find the next uh, zone that I need to find. This is a huge map, huh? I know that's a bridge right there. I just want to check around. I want to see what there is to see. Got another special guy here. Slowing him up. Frost Nova. I don't know if that actually slows, to be honest, the uh, Frost Nova. I know that my, um, what is this called? Cold Snap. I know that that slows people up. And that's why I use it so often when kiting melee. What is Ghost Foil? Oh, it's just a uh, stupid little rapier. Reaper. Reap, rape, rapier? I think it's called Rapier. Some more archers. I've been hearing people say in global chat, uh, which I actually shut off <laughs> when doing the Let's Plays, because... It just, we would end up with a whole bunch of shenanigans up there. Um, but I, I've been seeing a lot of people saying that the ranged mobs are overpowered. I don't know that I felt that. Maybe that's because I'm a ranged class. Maybe it's overpowered um, as a melee class. I don't know. But I haven't really noticed that. Oh, that guy died quick, huh? You got blue gloves? I think I've got better gloves than blue. I think so. I don't remember. Oh no, not necessarily. Let me see what those do. Got three blue slots. That's actually insane. 27% increase uh, crit rating for spells. That's really good. Um, yeah, that's really, really good. Must take, please. That's awesome. Wow. Just get rid of these. Keep going. Glad I went this direction. Those are pretty badass gloves, my friends. They are indeed. Alright, I'm just gonna go over the bridge, I guess. I'm not seeing anything here. Not seeing anything worthwhile. Alright, so yes, my uh, my potions will only recharge when I kill something. So, certainly important to note. Slow up the melee guy. Rule number one. What did I just do? That was stupid. Oh, look at that monkey coming down that tree. What a silly monkey. Get you. Get you. Okay. Let's keep going, though. Jeez, I'm crow. I'm mean, actually getting nothing accomplished. I'm going to check the middle first, and then I'll go over the bridge. I, I Sometimes I feel like there's got to be... I mean, there's got to be something in the middle, right? It's just some f stupid epic monkey. All right, something besides a crap ton of mobs. Is there something else in the middle here? Uh, and right, I'm just going to keep aggroing more guys. <laughs> Let me go ahead and engage here. I a shock nova level one. Oh, I don't know if that's gonna be any good actually. Oh, There's a lot, a lot of dudes here, huh? Oh wow. Okay, I see what they're talking about with those range guys. <laughs> I just got laced up by those archers. Jeez. All right. Freeze them so that they stop shooting me nonstop. Where'd they go? Did I kill them? Right, let me check shock nova. These are gloves, but those are the double red. Nothing that I really need. Medium mana flask. That's really good. Let me see if that will be uh, worthy of replacing one of mine. So this has got 16 extra char This is a ample miner than a regular miner and an ample miner. This one's 28% increased resistance during recovery. Adds knockback during recovery. Hmm. Recharges fully when you deal a critical strike. Wow. That is fantastic. Going to replace that crap. Get that, 16 extra charges or resistance. Uh, what is the total, 76 charges? This one's a total of 60, so I'll hold on to this other one. Get rid of this, great, yeah, that's awesome. That was pretty badass. That's actually really, really good. That's what action RPGs are, they're all about the loot, guys. You get badass loot, makes your day. Let me open this chest. I got a scroll of wisdom over here, and a whetstone. I don't know why I missed those. Probably because I had that stupid thing unselected. It wasn't showing me my loots. Who's this guy? Oh, another special. So I'd like to know what these guys are called. 
Um, if you guys know, are these rare monsters or are they called something else? Arcanist Vest. I don't think that's going to be better than the epic one I have. Yeah, definitely not. I've got a yellow vest. Screw that. Screw that one. Let's keep going down. Find our way across here. And no, oh, there's a house over here. Or something like it. A tent. That's what it is. Ah, they're coming from all angles. Hitting me from every side. Oh, jeez. Alright, so if you have any sort of debilitating spells, use them on these archers. Because, okay, I'm getting destroyed, actually. So, yeah, I'm going to try to use my freezes on those guys as much as possible. Simply because... Jeweler's Orb! Oh, no! I guess the difficulty is increasing. Maybe it's just me being bad. Jeweler's Orb, huh? Let's take a look at what that is, shall we? First we kill the sniper. We got a tribal club and a shield. Okay, let's, let's see this orb. Let's see this fancy orb here. Actually, I'm going to put this one over here. Number three. There we go. So, Jeweler's Orb. Right click on this item. Left click on another item to re-roll the socket layout. Okay, so let's... That's a good one. Then I've got the armor shield, uh, orbit transmutation as well. Let me put all this stuff on the bottom. As well as my whole whetstone. Actually, go ahead and equip that. Shock Nova. Okay, what is this? Cast a shocking circle of lightning deals uh, maximum damage as during the outside edge. At the outside edge. Okay. All right. Well, let me... Uh, I guess I can equip that. I've got plenty of blue slots now with these gloves. And let's see what that bad boy does. Let's put him... What do we got for damage here? Six to 120 lightning damage, huh? Oh, that looks beautiful. Oh, yeah. What's the mana cost? And it costs is eight. So same thing as the Ice Nova. Uh, and it's a faster cast time. You know what actually I'm going to do? I'm going to start using that. I'm not a lightning. Once I start getting increased cold damage, though, then it, does, it won't make sense for me to uh, use that as often. But I'm going to give it a shot for now. Ooh, that looks... That looks... <laughs> uh, I gotta admit, this is making me want to change to uh, <laughs> to a lightning witch because that that is beautiful. That is absolutely beautiful. Oh my gosh, guys! Oh uh, no, do I, I can't. I, can I respec? <laughs> can I please respec to lightning? Ugh. Oh, that looks so. That looks so sexy. All right, that's enough about that, though. Oh my gosh. I can't even handle it, guys. Yeah, but I'm pretty sure that once I get the uh, increased frost damage from my uh, from my speckage, from my my passive spec, then it'll be worthwhile to use the other one. That one's a little bit slower, though. What does it also? It does. No, oh, it doesn't even slow. At least it doesn't say it does. I have passives that do that for me. Who knows, really? I'm gonna. I can't wait to use that shock nova though in a massive group. In the not too distant future, if we find one. What do we got going on over here? Oh yeah, I was also informed that yes, it is in, in, in tr it is true that maps are randomized in this game. So I was wondering that. I did pose the question in my last video, but now I know. So the most damage is done to the outside. So I actually try to keep these guys at bay when spamming that. All right. Got another jeweler's orb. That's good. Nothing under that boulder. Nothing worthwhile, at least. I'm gonna keep going along my path here. This uh, wow, this this whole area is taking a long time. There we go. Dark forest. Oh, well, that's spooky. That's spooky indeed. I haven't picked up these waypoints though. I kind of wish that I that I got some waypoints somewhere. Or did I? Did I? I might have picked up the waypoints. It's been so long. This has been a long zone, huh? It's a pretty big zone. But here I go. Dark forest. Dark forest. Not as much light. Darkness is actually just the absence of light, in case you were wondering. All right, so wow. Did I really miss all that? Jeez. Wow, I'm pretty bad, apparently. <laughs> I'm pretty bad at picking up waypoints, apparently, because I'm at the dark forest uh, before I got any additional waypoints, but that's okay, whatever. Ugh. All right, here we go. Absence of light forest. But yeah, it's... it's uh. Darkness is the absence of light. That's how it works. Did you guys take science? 
Any sort of science classes? Alright, let me, let me go with my lightning Shiza here. Oh yeah, they don't like that. Actually, a few of them, uh, weren't really affected. Overall, though, I do prefer, uh, you know, it, obviously it depends on viability in whatever game that I'm playing. Oh, I've got talent points, don't I? It depends on viability in whatever game that I'm playing, but I like, uh, the snare type casters, so slowing up. So cold is, a. Uh, is a favorite of mine. I did also realize that I kind of screwed this up. I had initially planned to go this way as it was the kind of the path of least resistance to my increased cold damage, but um, didn't end up working out that way. Let me see where the, yeah, so lightning damage is over here. I wonder if I can respec. I don't know. I guess it doesn't matter. I'm going to stick with cold. I just, I can't get over how amazing that spell is though. All right, so I've got four. Uh, I'm going to get increased cast speed, increased mana. You can see also each additional point uh, adds a strength, dexterity, and more importantly, the larger of the numbers is intelligence. I think that's something that I, I kind of glossed over in the past. I wanted to make note of that. So there we go. Got increased cast speed, critical strike, uh, some damage multiplier for my crits, and now I'm starting to work my way straight up to the cold. So uh, we'll be getting there soon. We will be getting there soon. And I also mentioned in one of the first videos, uh, kind of some, a sort of disdain for the uh, the way the setup was for the skill tree. I don't think it's awful, and you know I definitely see uh, I like I like the the customization of it. I just think navigating it is what can be uh, I don't know having to having to click and drag out of it, and like you see like I'm still being attacked right now. <laughs> you know what I mean? I don't know if I'm actually taking damage in that. I'm assuming I am, but. Um, I think the navigation of that could just be a little smoother is the, is the word I'm looking for. I'm a pretty positive person. I usually have... Wow, what is that thing? Holy hell. Midnight Behemoth, you are scary. Jeez. That is gigantic. Does this path through? It does. It goes right through trees. All right, Midnight Behemoth. Freeze your ass. Not your ass, but... <laughs> Wow, those guys are spooky, man, oh man. Not gonna, I don't wanna mess with those guys, look at them. All mal malformed and ugh, ugh, man. Scary stuff, guys. Getting the heebie-jeebies. All right, let me use my cold one, and then lightning, lightning their faces. That's it's pretty overpowered, <laughs> to, to be perfectly honest, at least right now. At least right now it seems a little overpowered. I don't know. I don't know. I feel like I could just spam the the snare AoE and then this lightning will <laughs> just go through everything like that. I'll use my cold spells though. There's a bunch more guys. Yeah, look at that. I took them out with the one frost one even. Cause I'm pretty sure I do have increased frost damage already, even without, even without specking into it. No, I mean, yeah, I said it. So yeah, keep guys on the fringe of this because the increased damage is on the outer edge. Oh, that's no good. Time to move. No, that's not what I meant to do. There we go. targeting issue here. Should have it though. Not too concerned. The uh, the range on this is much better too. All right, I just need to target fire these guys down. No more jokes. Actually, no. Run. Okay. All right, that's it. I'm gonna focus. See this? I can't. It's so. I can't talk. What is this? What? What's happening? Oh, I'm on fire. <laughs> I was like, what is in the upper right? Did someone target me for hostile. I really thought that's what happened. I thought I was in someone's crosshairs. Although I, I'm pretty sure this stuff's instanced. Instanced, and you just have to. Uh, you have to be in a party for someone to be in the game with you. And actually, I mentioned last time um, I was wondering about the PvP. I think that that's literally just how it works. Like, um, there might be another mode of PvP, but I think that it's just some sort of variation of hostile uh, within your party. But that's something that I'll, I'll have to look into. I need to I need to find out because um, I would like to know because I do want to uh, get some PvP action done. 
Alright, so there's a there's a uh, badass spider there, but apparently he hurt his leg or something because he is uh, incredibly slow. And evidently not much of a challenge at all. However, I would have been scared had he got within range. Dark Force is looking nice too. Let's see what we got here. It's uh, one of those behemoth dudes. I'm just going to walk right by him. I think that's a good idea. Tribal chest. Let's see what we got. Some tribesmen to protect it. The see again. Look at see. I'm targeting behind me, and those last two shots were not going in the direction that my mouse was facing. So again, I'm not sure if it's because I am doing something incorrectly, or if the targeting just needs to be a little uh, smoother, if you will. I feel like that's what it is, though, because I know I know what I'm doing. Just not doing what I'm telling it to. Let's keep going here. Find out what's beyond the dark forest. See, I'm, I'm, I might even play through the rest of this act, given the fact that I'm evidently halfway through it right now. I can't believe I missed so many waypoints, though. Seriously, I... I don't know. Typically, when you enter a zone here, it's been being the case that the waypoints are um, near the... They're right near the front, you know? But uh, definitely didn't happen for Act 2, at least not thus far. Because I burnt right through it. Let's keep checking the fringe of the map, though. Typically, wherever the next area is, is on the edge. All right. Oh, here we go. All right, next zone. Next zone, my friends. Alira's, Alira's camp. I want, is Alira one of the chicks I need to kill? I think she might be. Let me check my uh, quest log. Oh, uh, yeah, here we go. We're at Lever's camp, guys. All right, so I need to kill this lady. She needs to die. Let me get this waypoint. Go find Alira. Pools and streams. <laughs> Waterfall Cave 1. Looking forward to the rest of this. Act 2's been cool. All right, Alira. Where are you at? I don't know if I'm ready for this. What level am I? I'm 14. I need another level before I can get my wall. Uh, I'm not gonna go back. I would go back, but that would make me look like a wimp. So let me see if I can level up here before I get to Alira. I want to get 15 because that gets me uh, the next spell right here. Frost Wall, and I cannot imagine that that is not absolutely amazing. I have the feeling that that, that spell will be badass. Okay, this is evidently... An impassable wall. Archers die. So yeah, people were complaining in the general chat that uh, the range, the range guys, I already said this, I'm just reiterating, that the ranged NPCs in this game are overpowered. So again, I don't know uh, my verdict on that matter, but um, I definitely have experienced things that would make them seem strong. People just like to say things are overpowered. I mean, hell, even me, I was like, oh, look at this lightning nova overpowered. Just the nature, you know? It's, it's, it's the nature of us complainers. <laughs> I'm probably the furthest thing from a complainer that there is. I actually don't complain enough. Hmm. Something to think about. Something for me to mull over. As I hack and slash my way through Path of Exile. What is that? Gold gold braid? Nine to fire resist? Don't care. Sorry. I don't care about that. I, I love this flask. It recharges fully when you deal a critical strike. So that's a perfect example of something uh, that will be beneficial in a boss fight. Why can I not hit him? There we go. Um, that's a that's a perfect example right there. You know that will recharge in a boss fight as long as I'm getting crits. So, so yes, sir. Get the rest of these guys. Yeah, I, I've been missing some targeting. I don't know what it is. I don't know if it's collision detection issues or, but it's. Uh, I mean, again, like I just, yeah, I don't know. Just sometimes my guy's not firing in the direction that I uh, am pointing, and that's something that should be addressed. I believe that is something worth fixing. Alright, get a couple of these guys frozen up. I really cannot let those guys uh, get within range of me. They hurt. Okay. 
Take him. Take him out. Alright, so, I'm getting close to 15. I'm probably also getting close to Alira, though. Ah, that's probably where she is. Giant campfire in the middle of the map. Uh, wouldn't surprise me. Let me see if I can get these guys before they're even within range. How well this is going. It's not bad. Alright, got some super buffed up archers there. Should be able to take them out pretty quick. I love Cold Snap, the the targeted freezing. It's not guaranteed freeze, I, I wish it was, but um, randomization, of course, is a good thing. Uncertainty is a good thing. I don't know, maybe she's not there. I'm gonna go there. I'm about to hit I'm about to hit the level though. Let me see if I can hit the level first. And I'll check that. There it is. Alright, 15. Time for Frostwall. I'm gonna do it in combat. F it. Go to Q. Frostwall. Alright. What's it look like? <laughs> yes! That is a beautiful spell. That's gonna help me deal with archers so easily. Oh, that is absolutely beautiful. Look at that. Oh yeah. It's 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 not uh it doesn't last very long, but. Just, just long enough. Just long enough. I'm loving it. All right. Some more guys here at the campfire. Frostwall. Suckers. Can I, can I spam that too? Multiple. Yes, I can. It does do damage too, and uh, and people who are like trapped within it, they get uh, they take damage or something like that as well. Let me, let me read over it. Uh, under the wall of damage and push back. Okay, so that's how it works. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Um, sir, I'm going to abuse that. <laughs> uh, in PvE and PvP. The one thing I am really hoping for that I haven't found yet as well is a, um, a mobility. I, I would like some sort of a mobility... Some sort of a mobility spell. Because that is something that I lack at the moment. I want uh, something equivalent to a blink teleport sort of deal that'd be awesome now I can I now I feel confident coming up against Alira Alira yeah I'm gonna abuse the crap out of that that's so awesome that is really so awesome that that completely like that helps me completely deal with casters like without pause I have no problem now coming up against casters. Until I find something that breaks that, I am no longer frightened of such said uh, range classes. Just need to get my bearings though here. Picking up all these new spells. Gotta get things figured out. Alright, let's keep going. Let's keep trucking on through here. What do we got for time? Been playing for a while. It's been about a half hour. Gonna keep going though. i just do this full playthrough. Get a bunch of it up for you guys tonight. I think at like about an hour at a time seems reasonable. You know? About an hour's worth of this content every day. And then also uh, the StarCraft strategies. Pretty much anything on the schedule. And then now, you know, since I got into the beta, obviously we'll be adding this to that to that schedule as well. So. Just a... Okay. I'm trying to do too much at once. And no! Ah! Oh! Ah, oh, no. Oh, that's embarrassing. Hang my head in shame. Ugh. All right. Crap. Friggin' A. You see, it's your fault, actually. Because <laughs> it's uh, hard to talk and focus on the gameplay at the same time. Yeah, I'm not going to I'm not gonna make that tell excuse. That was, that was just me being baddie. That was me being a baddie. Walking all haphazardly into stuff. Thinking I could just abuse my new frost wall. They showed me, huh? If this was hardcore, I would be very angry. <laughs> and I will be playing hardcore. And uh, I may try it in the beta. Uh, I think for beta's sake, though, it, I don't know how much sense it makes. Because with the beta, I'm trying to you know expose and test out as much content as possible. And uh, if I have to tiptoe around everything for fear of death, then... I mean, I guess th that's exactly that. I mean, if I were playing hardcore, I would not just be, like, running around all willy-nilly. But the, the, the truth of the matter is I'm trying to, uh, trying to get as much content for you guys as possible. 
So, okay, come on. There we go. I've noticed some bugs with sounds too. I don't know if you guys have just noticed like a lack of sound at certain times, but it's there. It has been there for sure. All right, I keep just running into new mobs. This is uh, this is actually really bad. I just keep uh, aggroing more stuff with all my antics. Ugh, all right, time to focus. I don't know how people do it. I don't know how they commentate while they play. I don't know how I'm doing it right now. It's so hard to concentrate, you know? <laughs> I've tried doing this with StarCraft, but you have to focus so much in that game as well that 